So Maha Long gets frame three underway. Oh, wonderful pot. That was the more difficult of the three pots available to him, but felt that was the best one to get access to the black. So he'll be feeling but finished perfect on that red. Nine. He's just about got high enough on the blue, put it on a sixpence. This is a wonderful chance for Mark Allen. <coughs> Don't want to make it sound easy because it's not to win the frame one visit, but that's the sort of high standard these players set themselves. Tight control is there, and he's disappointed with that one. So he's tried again there. A little bit fortunate to get the 36. next cannon, which has left him dead straight on the red. Seven. So obviously, he likes to move around the table, he doesn't like to hang Nine. about. As Joe said earlier on, he'd be disappointed. Effort. Up in snook up, which tells you how far the cube will actually travels during a century break. Pretty inevitable when he comes to the table, when he plays up. And he hasn't disappointed. This has been a wonderful break. Possible one four three on as well, so his shot selection or shot every shot time I should say will be coming down. But this last frame, I would have thought it's more like fifteen to eighteen somewhere around with there. He started with come into play. Thanks the slower time there. And that's his twenty ninth of the season. He's into a new sentry of sentries. One hundred and sixteen. One hundred and nineteen. Well, 123. this has been master class in break building. One hundred and twenty eight. One hundred and twenty eight. Max. An absolute majestic break of 141 from Mark Allen.